welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. We're live the home of the Chicago Bulls, the United Center. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Looking at Chicago, they took the win in their last game against the Charlotte Hornets. Yeah, I felt like they attacked, but with a purpose. They knew what they wanted to accomplish coming in. Well, it really showed the trust they have in one another. I love how they got after it, and you could feel that they were playing for each other. Here are the starters for Las Vegas. Out there with Stone. Then there's Toppin. The paint. Now, here's Clark. He takes it in. Pass to Stone. Clark with it. Just five on the clock. From the arc. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. What's the most important thing, Clark, a player has to focus on when it's this early in the season? Well, I think one is making sure you're in really good shape and then getting comfortable with your teammates is another element. And getting your chemistry and timing back. Those are probably the most important things. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Oldman. Well, Kevin, here's what Las Vegas' head coach had to say earlier. He knows that Devin Booker is going to get his points, but what they want to do is prevent the freebies. Coach said Booker's become exceptional at drawing fouls, and he's one of the best free throw shooters in the game. So, Kevin, they don't want to see him on the line multiple times tonight. Back to you. Thanks, David. Now, here's Toppin. The putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Oh, great timing. He is one tough customer on that offensive glass. It's like he has a sixth sense of where that rebound is going. And that sixth sense, guys, might be better than just about anybody else. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Now, here's Washington. That's a no-go, and he's still looking for his first bucket after two shots. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. You know, right now, they're just one for five. Rough start so far. now. They trail by three. Booker the bounce pass. Here's Stokes. It's Clark with the rebound. And Clark has got the ball here for Las Vegas. Pass to Shakur. Good on the bucket. Really, the defense is helpless to stop a layup right there. Just too much of an advantage in terms of the mismatch. the pass to Stokes. He can't get that one. It's almost as if there's a lid on the hoop for him right now. He still hasn't gotten one to fall in the court. Shakur passes to Clark. Pass to Stone. Here is Shakur. Stolen away. We're approaching about three and a half minutes played in the first quarter. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Now, here's Clark. Right wing. Some nice passing by Las Vegas here. Trills the three-pointer. Clark's got a couple of threes now in the first for Las Vegas. Already finding the spots and capitalizing, playing timeout, really timeout. efficient timeout, basketball. Timeout, timeout. And the first timeout of the game Started. called for Chicago. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going.
strong the pass to Thompson on the wing Thompson here's strong that's in coming off the assist from Thompson that's a textbook example of how to move the ball boy you gotta love that action this is it to Stone and another three for Las Vegas all these threes they're giving up have really been the driving force on this run Thompson outside and they come right back with their own three point Thompson's got his second bucket of the night for real come at us and we're coming right back at you a little back and forth from long range I love it that's a terrific answer there pass to Stone there's the triple and another three for Las Vegas and they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five mates are from beyond the arc. It's hard for me to watch this. I mean, the defense practically giving them those shots. Now here's Booker. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Stokes kicks to Thompson. Lock at six. Shoots it. Used the shot fake to create the angle, but couldn't get it to fall. Clark inside. Six points for him. That's good, and he's now three for four from the field. <laughs> Defensively, they've got to pick up the intensity. Hard to win surrendering this high a field goal percentage. Yeah, you've got to turn up the dial on the intensity at the defensive end if you're them. I mean, it's still early, but I agree with you. Now here's Booker. Now the pass to Strong. Deep three-point range. It's going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. The ball goes to the away team. Stewart checked in for Coming Stokes. Coming the floor for your Bulls, Isaiah Stewart. And here's Las Vegas. They're on an 18-7 run. Stone passes to Clark. Drives to the hoop. Got it for his fourth field goal of the game on just five shots. This is as good as it gets for a first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. You're exactly right. I mean, everything seems to be dropping. Impressive scoring here. Thompson outside. Five on the clock. Passes it to Strong. Elbow shot is on the way. That shot is off. And it's Las Vegas the other way. Here's Stone. Six points for him. Keeps it alive. Great positioning on the putback. And Las Vegas leads by 15. Excellent all-around performance so far. Hence the big lead. Yeah, you know, they've had the advantage at both ends. They've got all the momentum early on. Now Las Vegas moving it up. Here's Stone. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Stone's got eight points. And you can see he's got a little bounce in his step. Three out of four to start. Chicago calls timeout. Yeah, things not Ladies going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. And you know what, guys? If for nothing else, just to slow things down a little bit, change it up somewhat. Bulls trail by 17. Over to the left wing. And here's Stewart. He's still scoreless so far in this one. They need this. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two OB shots coming up. Him. It's going to be That's on Obi Top. First team foul. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for Las Vegas. 
boy, the three-point oh, shot has yeah. really been dropping for him early on. Also, guys, the passing has been terrific in the first half. They'll be happy with all those assists. Two shots. Relax on the first. And the first one at the line is good. That misses, so he splits the free throws. Las Vegas leading by 16. Clark, the pass to Shakur. Shakur, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Tell you what, forget about easing into the game. They came out with punt blazing. Kicks to a Okoro. Six to shoot. Shoots over Toppin. Hits the front of the rim and out. The defense did a really good job of choking off the middle there once he got inside. Now, here's Clark. He's got 10. And the basket by Stone. And the defense is in disbelief here. Triple after triple. When that happens, you simply just hope they start cooling off. Shoots. Third time is not the charm. 0 for 3 for the floor so far. To the inside. Here's Toppin. And he gets Obi it to go. Toppin. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. And, you know, that involves pounding it inside, getting as many points as you can right at the rim. That demoralizes the team. And here are the Bulls now, following the score by Obi Toppin. And the stroke definitely lacking confidence this quarter. Nothing on target. And that yes, one, good. Eight points for him. And loving the hustle here early. I mean, they struck first on the offensive glass. And those put-back baskets contributing to their lead. Now, here's Okoro. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. And they've won the rebound battle so far, and it's translated to the scoreboard. Well, the effort level they've had has been outstanding. Hard to keep a team down when they play with that much energy. Here's Clark. Cuts off the pass. Driving inside. They get it back. Balmaro. They can't stop the run with that one. Pass to Stone. Clark with it. Guarded now by Okoro. Some nice passing by Las Vegas here. Washington, that's good. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. And don't leave out the coaching staff here now. I mean, their game plan has been perfect. 146 left to play in the first quarter. And again, Chicago, no good. And there's the oh, whistle for the illegal screen. Uh, beyond the leading, you can see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. Yeah, I agree. You know, sometimes that can be a tough call for the refs to make, but not that time. It was easy there. Hall's checked in for Chicago. Here's Hall. Stewart passes to Hall. Back to Stewart. A good finish at the rack off the slick feed. And a nice job here early of establishing an inside presence. We've got 108 left here in the opening quarter. Here's ABC. That one goes. Count it. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Now, here's Stewart. Pass to Hall. Shot clock at six. And there's the pass to Baltimore. That three off target had some space there after the little pump fake. 
They've been sensational on the Number backboard 40. to start this game. Yeah, sensational is a really good word for it. They're tearing it up on the glass. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Now, here's Clark. Tight defense on him. Here's ABC from 12 feet out. That one, no good. And the buzzer sounds to end the first, and we've got a blowout underway here. Las Vegas ahead, just dominating this one. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter. Side of the game. We'll see if that changes here in a second. And from what we've seen from Las Vegas so far, guys, what are you seeing? What we saw in that first quarter, uh, they won their matchups defensively. Yeah, I agree. I mean, you look at the energy, the effort defensively, they put it all out there in that opening quarter. Here's ABC on the court right now for Las Vegas. They've got Riley. He's out there with ABC, and it's ABC in at the three. And we're seeing some great ball movement out of this group, guys. Here's Bomar. No points in the game yet for him. Here's Stokes. That shot misses, and it's Las Vegas the other way. Here's ABC, passes it to Riley. Here's ABC, fires the three, and another three for Las Vegas. Uh, unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flames. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming, attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. Stokes can't get it to go. Trailing here in the game, you can look at his performance as a direct indicator of why they're losing. Takes the 13-footer, and it's wide right. It's off the rim. Boy, you've really got to put those away, especially against soft interior defense. A great team oh, oh, punctuated by a strong finish. That is the perfect the fast break, guys. Getting a hoop before the defense can get set. Here's ABC. He's got five. Riley can't hit. Now, here's Okoro. Defense is right there. Three on three. And Riley gets it to go. And I think that play sort of sums up what we've seen tonight. Just simply being outplayed both sides of the ball. Smart basketball defensively turning into easy points. Count that one. And if you're the guy who has to guard him, it is never going to be an easy night for you. Shepard, the pass to Sharp. Some nice passing by Las Vegas here. Here's Allman. And it's off the back rim. No good. ABC has gone one of three shooting so far. Here's Stokes. Makes it off the glass. Time out, time out. Stokes has got his first two points of the night. Love that dish down low. And first time out of the game called for Las Vegas. And in 2021, we saw Tim Duncan enter the Hall of Fame. What do you think of his iconic bank shot? And Clark, why don't more players, you think, perfect that shot? Well, you know what? Shots that are that iconic are really hard to master. So I think some legends have just perfected something that few others can master in the same way. That's part of it. And then the other part of it is that... Um, the game is so different now. It's a three-point shooting game. You don't necessarily need a signature shot. If you can shoot it from deep and drive it, then you can play in today's NBA.
and we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Pass to Washington. Here is Shakur, guarded by Stewart. They get it back. Now the Bulls with it. Thompson right side. Out of bounds. Las Vegas takes possession. Away team ball. A moment now to see how the schedule is looking for Las Vegas. On Sunday, the San Antonio Spurs come into town, tipping off a homestand for them. Then on Monday, they head out on the road to face the Suns in Phoenix. Here's ABC. He's got five. Shakur kicks to Toppin. Pass to Washington. Over Thompson. Off the left rim and out. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that. He, he gets it in there. With the they are attacking the rim and getting great results. And how? I mean, they're taking this defense to task, taking them to school. Every one of their last 10 points have come in the paint. Now, here's Washington. Las Vegas again missing. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. And the basket by Stokes. And this has been a great Just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. Here's ABC. Washington passes to Riley. Down to five on the shot clock. That one a little long. The shooting numbers just aren't there yet in the quarter. Thompson misses. Now Washington to end the cold streak. And then Washington with the dunk. And the one-hand slam just looks so pretty when it's in his hand and he's the one doing the slam. Agreed. He is smooth as silk, even on a power finish. Part of what makes him unique, guys, a combination of power and polish. And just a step ahead of the D in that possession there, making the pass. Nice assist. The pass to Shakur. He kicks it to Toppin. Now, here's Washington. He's covered by Thompson. Chalk up two there. And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. And it's Stewart, top of the key. Passes to Hall. Takes the three. It's rebounded by Las Vegas. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one. They've asserted their Only will and have taken control on the glass. When you allow good scorers to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. Yeah, you know, he should be getting extra attention from the defense. Not wow. Sweet find there by Booker. All eyes on him with time the ball. Time time Devin time. understands that. That has a nice Sorry. feel for giving up the rock. Las Vegas calls timeout. And, and you know, Booker might have been a volume shooter, at least early in his career, but now he's a legit number one option for an offense. Pass to Shakur. Washington kicks to Clark. The pass to Shakur. Back to Clark. Just five to shoot. 18 feet away, and he knocks it down. Clark's got 12. 
And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. And you know that's how it goes with him. I mean, this hot streaks guys don't last minutes. They last days. Now here's Booker. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Thompson inside the line. And the shot falls short this time. Down low. Here's Shakur. And he goes in for the dunk. Terrific accuracy on that pass. That's how you lead your teammate. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. And Thompson gets it to go. Thompson's got eight here in the quarter. Boy, he's doing everything he can at this point. The rest of his teammates need to step up and give him some help. And how about the communication between teammates on that alley-oop? And that's what you need to pull that thing off. Boy, both ends of that play, guys, were fantastic. Stripped it away. Pass to Riley. Fires for three. And another three for Las Vegas. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. Thompson outside. It's deflected. Going inside. Offensive rebound. Tries again. Here's Shakur. Persistence pays off as they finally hit a shot. 14 points for him. Uh, there he is, beasting on the glass, converting the opportunity, trying to put this game away. Well, he enjoys deflating the opposition with those extra possessions. Now here's Booker. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. And just miss after miss right now. Riley against Booker. Clark, the pass to Washington. Good D by Thompson. You know, it hasn't been his best outing, but they still find themselves in the driver's seat here. Man, what a pass that was there. He really, really relishes making the game easier for his teammates. Now, here's Clark. He's tightly guarded. Passes it to Toppin. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. That's his first personal foul. I'll tell you what, he earned his money foul. on that foul. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that That's you don't give a chance team. for the and one. Only He's getting his in. first free throw attempt of the Two night shots. right now. Shooting two. Free throw is good by Chapman. Okoro, he's checked in for Chicago. And then for Las Vegas, Jefferson comes in for Washington. And it's Stone in for Riley. That one falls, so he hits both of them. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Got a piece of it. Clark right side. Throws down the alley-oop slam. Now the Bulls with it. Booker outside. And they're on the break. Feeds it to Jefferson. Here's Stone. He's got 11. Back to Jefferson. Clark outside. Five to shoot. Up again. It's good on the putback. And he's starting to show that killer instinct this quarter, looking to extend the lead. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two Booker minutes. looking around. Clark has got the ball here for Las Vegas. Inside, here's Toppin. 
can't cash in from close range. Toppin's gotten three of his eight shots to go, around 37%. We've got 128 left here in the second. Into the lane, and Toppin Obi throws Toppin. it down. And a hard finish there, guys. Yeah, and only one hand needed for that one. Sometimes that's all you need. Booker, and the dunk by Booker. Booker. And there he goes, Booker, showing off the vert. Clark, outside. 58 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. No good. Shot missing. So the Bulls will take it the other way. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Here's Stone. 11 points in the game. High arcing shot. Here's Jefferson. Off target at the rim. So far, we've seen them be a bit careless with the ball. Simply put out of control. This is how they played thus far. They're going to have to reel it in and show some more discipline. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Here's Strong. And that one, good. <laughs> that was just a perfect possession. Getting it in tight for the high percentage shot. Here's Stone, defended by Booker. Clark for three, and so it's Las Vegas with a major 39-point lead here at the end of the quarter, and they're winning the turnover battle very easily in this one. We come back right after this. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the 2K Sports Halftime Program. I'm Ernie Johnson alongside Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny DeJetsmith. Checking out Las Vegas. Kenny, how'd you feel about it? Well, they've been incredible from beyond the arc. They're scoring the three in bunches, sinking them at a high rate. If the defense continues to allow open looks in the second half, I'll keep saying, fire, fire. How about you, Shaq? What did you think about Chicago? They've been struggling to get shots in general, but down low, they've been paid for something. Hate to say it. Giving up way too many years ago. If they can't protect the rim more effectively in the second half, it's going to be a long ride home. And that does it for our halftime show. We now take you back to Kevin Harlan for the start of the third period. into the second half we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two so far it has been a runaway so it's las vegas now our second half of basketball and presented by gatorade let's see who's all fueled up and on the floor to start the third so for chicago right now they've got abc he's out there with thompson and it's strong in at the five well, you know, stopping him is never easy to do, but the defense was strong there. It's stolen. On the wing, Thompson. And down it goes. Dunk threw off a wonderful assist. Ooh, that's a double whammy, guys. <laughs> that's right. A great defensive play, then the emphatic stump. Well, turning defense to offense, we talk about it all the time. Try to hit your opponent at the other end before they can set up the defense. How about the range on that jump shot? I love seeing this guy when he's in form. Pass to Booker. Shot clock at five. And here's Las Vegas. The pass to Washington. And he banks in the layup. Washington's got eight points. It's a great move, and he catches the defense completely off guard. Yeah, if that's a harbinger of things to come, he's looking at having a very big second half. Here's Stokes. Six points for him. 
can't hit the turnaround jumper. And you know what? He's just not on his game. No doubt about it. Their deficit isn't totally on him, but he has not been an asset for his team. Now, here's Washington. Here's Shakur. No good with the elbow jumper. Here's Chicago. Takes it inside, and it's blocked. From 13, and off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for him. Washington's got four this quarter. Thompson, left side. And hustle like that is why he leads this team in rebounds tonight. And I tell you what, guys, nobody's been more physical in this game than he has. He has been a glass eater. Now, here's Washington. He's got 10. That one falls. Obi Toppin. Washington's gotten six of his 12 shots to drop, hitting 50% on the night. The drive by Booker. Lays it up off the glass. Booker's got his second basket of the night. And great energy from Booker there in the paint. Just working hard to get to his shot. Clark kicks to Shakur. Kept alive. Now the Bulls with it. To the middle. Here's Thompson. And he lays it straight in. 15 points in the game. Yeah, he's been hooping. But the rest of the team, not so much. Clark with it. He's got 12. Here's Washington. Chicago grabs the miss. Stokes has got his fourth rebound in this one. He's covered by Clark. Strong the pass to Thompson. He watches it go through the hoop for his eighth make. Now eight for 14. I mean, he's just been brilliant today, guys. And it was the same exact story last time out. I wasn't quite sure if he'd be able to maintain that same level of play. I had my doubts coming into this game. But consider my doubts disappeared. And here are the Bulls now. After Las Vegas picked up three with their last shot. No good from Booker. Booker's gone just two of six shooting, 33%. Clark outside. Here's Washington. The lead pass was put in just the right spot. Washington's got 14 points for the game. Uh, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball move. Really a prime example of the difference in how these teams have operated offensively. Much more individual play at the other end. And that was lining up to be a huge alley-oop, but they just couldn't quite connect. And you know, guys, always a tough catch on the lob. Placement and timing have to be close to perfect. And it's the Bulls with the ball. After the basket by Las Vegas. He's covered by Clark. And Thompson kicks to Stokes. On the clock. Can they get it? The shot comes out, and it's Las Vegas the other way. Here's Stone, 19 points in the game. Here's Clark, again, Las Vegas score. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. And so here is Chicago. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. He's covered by Clark. Passes it to Strong. Oh, that's blocked. And they get it back. And here's Booker from the arc. That shot, no good. And here's Las Vegas. They're on an 18 to 6 run. Here's Clark driving to the basket. Slides through for his seventh basket in 11 tries. And a chance now to catch up on some numbers here. The hustle stats for Las Vegas. You know, block shots, guys, a clear indicator on the stat sheet of their excellent defense. I mean, leaving them no room to get off any shots. Yeah, but also, they haven't missed the beat in terms of their fast break game. That's been equally as effective all night long. Here's Clark. Devin Booker picking up that last basket. Some nice passing by Las Vegas here. A shot by Shakur, no good. He's covered by Clark. Kicks it to Thompson. Thompson. 
into the paint. And it's Thompson with the chance. An extremely efficient and productive game for him. But again, he's not going to be able to do it all by himself. Always going up for the alley-oop here. And it's Washington missing. And here are the Bulls now. Thompson inside. He's against Clark. Thompson with the bucket. You know, so far, he's been dominant this period, making the most of his opportunities. Pass to Shakur. Now, here's Washington. Fades back. Stokes with the rebound. Stokes has got seven rebounds in the game. Thompson against Clark. Nice move. Thompson misses. These guys have had some good motion on offense. Nice assisting. And, and when everyone's involved offensively, it has a way of helping you on the defensive side as well. A basket by Shakur. His shooting has been outstanding. <laughs> Definitely one of the reasons they're up in this game. Hangs home the trifecta. Yeah, clearly a defensive lapse there. He is automatic from deep if you're going to leave him that wide open. Big time mistake. Now, here's Clark. He's got 16. Here's Washington. Again, Las Vegas scores. It just seems like the more he touches it, the more the lead grows. Pass to Stokes. Thompson looking for an opening. Drops in the layup for two. Thompson's got 10 points here in the second half. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. Inside. Washington, that's good. Washington's got 18 points in the game. That is super efficient, getting in deep and then taking advantage. On the wing, Thompson. Strong, the pass to Thompson. Yes, that goes in. I tell you what, guys, there's not much more he can do. I mean, he's been on fire, yet they still trail in this game. And here is Clark. There's the pass to Washington. No good on the three. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for Chicago. Unloads from 13. It's Clark with the rebound. Two minutes remaining. Clark's got in his third. sixth rebound on the night. Two minutes. There's 154 left in the third. Pass to Shakur. Las Vegas shoot their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Taking two shots. Free throw good, Shakur. So Chicago ends up going with a new group. And Las Vegas will go for a different look here. Good on both. 146 left here in the third quarter. Here's Hall. This one for three. No good on the shot. And it's Las Vegas the other way. Pass to ABC. Here's ABC, guarded by Stewart. Here's Shepard. Chicago grabs the miss. Clearly the defense could have been better there, guys, but he also needs to convert that. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Now here's Okoro. He's guarded closely. Here's Hall, and there's the drive. It's rebounded by Jefferson. 
Here's Shepard. It's hauled in by Stewart. There's 37 seconds left in the third quarter. Balmaro, the pass to Stewart. And it goes down two points. Oh, Stewart's got a second bucket tonight. Huge hole in the defense that possession. He didn't waste any time cutting through it. Shakur kicks to Jefferson. And the pass to ABC. Teardrop shot. The time for the ball. And out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. Checking in for the away team. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. And big defensive plays like that will help them stay in control of this one. Here's Hall. Pass to Balmaro. With one on the clock. And he got that one up in time, but doesn't go in. The three quarters of play all in the books. And this one all but over already. Las Vegas ahead. Delivering the blowout. And time to step aside quickly, but we'll be back in no time with the start of the fourth quarter. Here now a chance to show you our assist of the game. And it's presented as always by State Farm. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Served him up a tasty room service dime right there, boy. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may be already out of hand. On the court right now for Las Vegas. ABC is on there with Clark, and it's Jefferson in at the four. Here's Hall. That one, no good. And it's Las Vegas the other way. Clark, we know injury prevention is a huge aspect for teams, and it seems like training staffs hold a lot more weight than they did in the past. I think you're exactly right, Kevin. No doubt about Number it. And for good reason. I mean, the medical staffs include doctors and trainers and physiotherapists and the like, and they really have enhanced what goes into preparing players for their seasons throughout their careers. And um, it's become more precise. It's better. Yet there are still going to be injuries, but the treatment and care players get now, I think, is platinum level across the league. Out of bounds, Las Vegas takes possession. The ball goes to the away team. Fourth quarter of basketball. We're about a minute into it. Now, here's Clark. Jefferson trying to break loose. No good from Clark. And so it's Rivers with it. He'll bring it up for Chicago. And it's blocked. Finished off the break. The only way he was getting to the hoop was to use the double clutch. We're just over a minute and a half now into the fourth. Out left to the wing. Passes it to Hall. Now here's Rivers. He's covered by Clark. Just four to shoot. And the Bulls with another miss. This has been a one-sided affair. Yeah, they've done a nice job of extending their lead and maintaining that intensity level. And Las Vegas making a change here. Washington's checked in. We're about two minutes into the fourth quarter in this one. Clark against Rivers. Pass to Baltimore. Over Washington. And misses it off the right side of the rim. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold streak. And he's got to find other ways to contribute then because his shot making 
is not happening right now. Chicago grabs the miss. Stewart's got six rebounds in the game. Rivers in the corner. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth quarter. Here's Hall. The pass to Stewart. Over Allman. And too long on the shot. And here's Las Vegas. Here in the fourth quarter, their defense has been very strong, allowing no baskets. And haven't we seen that a few times today, guys? I mean, their defense has got to have a little bit more toughness about it. And if it doesn't, this is only going to get uglier. I mean, that's no way to defend a player of his caliber. Now, here's Stewart. Pass to Hall. Passes it to Balmore. The Bulls need to get a shot off here. Here's Stewart. None of the miss, and they've really hit a rough patch here. Washington in zone. He's guarded by Rivers, and the shot is good. They're going to have to come up with a better matchup. This guy's just too much speed. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Here's Hall. Shoots from 12. The shot misses. And another miss. Oof. He's having a really ugly game. Yeah, about as ugly as you can have. You're right. Here's Balmar. Now Rivers. And Clark, the NBA is supporting those players who use their platform for change. In 2021, the NBA created the new Kareem Abdul-Jabbar Social Justice Award. Yeah, that sends a really powerful message because those who have followed the career of Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, he was my idol as I was growing up, know that he not only performs at the highest level between the lines, but he has always been a voice and an activist for social justice, for education, for doing what's right and decent. His career outside of basketball clearly embodies what being about human rights is all about. So that's a really powerful message and one that I'm glad to see the NBA put forth. Boy, that was a sweet looking teardrop. There's very little defense for that. Here's Hall. To the wing on the left. Here's Bomar. And the Bulls with another miss. No matter what looks they get, they just can't convert to stop this run. And, you know, they've got to be careful because this is when the team concept breaks down and guys start playing hero ball. Now here's Jefferson. Shot from 12. Rebounded by Bomar. Well, that's a rare miss for him inside. He may have just rusted a bit. Maybe lost concentration, too. The feed to Clark. That's down the hatch. Notch one more to his total. That's nine for 15 shooting. And not hard to see why they are giving up points on this run. Just too many good looks from in close. Here's Rivers, and it's blocked. So hard. Actually impossible to cut into the lead when you have a guy struggling this badly. And they pick up two. Just Mr. Reliable again here today, Kevin. I mean, they need his points. And he's producing. Here's Stewart after the basket by Las Vegas. And for the first time in 2021, Clark, we had the full play-in tournament featuring the 7 through 10 seeds. Uh, what would you think of the new format? I really enjoyed it. I mean, again, part of it was we're coming out of a pandemic and so all things sports and this added another level of excitement to i think the best game in the world nba basketball he had steph against lebron and ad so i think it was a pretty awesome result overall jefferson gets the bucket and i need to see some more assertiveness out of these defenders rivers against jefferson to the middle here's size disadvantage attacking the heart of that defense you know what a lot of height to give up 
They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Here's Hall. Three-pointer. It's rebounded by Las Vegas. Jefferson's got rebound number eight now on the night. Now, here's Washington. He's covered closely. Pass to ABC. Here's Hall. Stolen by Washington. Nice pass. Run right into the rack perfectly for the layup. Clark's got 22. Attacking in transition, the most consistent way to generate easy looks. Yep, exactly. And if there's any opportunity for early offense, you've got to push it and push it every time. Now, here's Stewart. Back to Rivers. And again, no good by Chicago. Now, here's Washington. Defense right on him. It's hauled in by Stewart. Stewart's got seven rebounds in the game. To the inside. The dish to Rivers. Clark, between the draft and free agency and big mid-season trades, it feels like we rarely see the same team twice season to season. Yeah, guys move around quite a bit more so than in the past, Kevin. I don't necessarily know if that's... Uh good or bad it's certainly different i tend to lean towards guys staying in the same place longer that would be my personal preference but the landscape has shifted and changed and um, it's overall probably a positive thing for the players trying to end the drought and he gets the whistle two free throws coming up that's his first personal foul first team foul at the line for the bulls number 40 at the line for two Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one drops. So for Las Vegas, Toppin comes in for Jefferson, and it's Stone in for ABC. He hits both from the strike. And Clark has got the ball here for Las Vegas. So far in the fourth quarter, they've allowed just six points. Down low, Shakur. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. 26 points for him. That's serving it up on the platter there. What a nice pass. A high percentage look was the result. Rivers against Clark. Some nice ball movement by the Bulls. Here is Lynch. Just five to shoot. Can't connect from short range. The pass to Stone. And here is Toppin. He feeds it to Clark. Inside. Shakur again Las Vegas wrong. scores and one team is just completely outclassing the other tonight spirited performance and it really ignited what is turning out to be a monster win here for Las Vegas this was a team performing to its uh, fullest capability uh, a, a hugely satisfying win a, a, a game that not many will soon forget and on the other side one that I think most will try to forget and ever win in court and this one will go down is win number three and i love what they accomplished here tonight made the plays they had to and that's why they'll go up one nothing in their season series against chicago now here's rivers and again 
Chicago. No good. Four seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Clark against Rivers. No good from Clark. Las Vegas taking the W here to come into an opponent's building and dominate the way they did tonight says I think Greg an awful lot about this team I, I guess they don't need home cooking to feel <laughs> at home I mean Kevin just a masterful performance all the way around well folks that's gonna do it for now for Greg Anthony Clark Kellogg and David Alden this is Kevin Harlan thanks for watching this presentation of the NBA on 2K Sports we'll see you next time